Let's see, pocket money 150, garden pots 10. And print round bracket. Pocket money round bracket. Print round bracket garden pots. Round bracket. Now, let's run this. Oh no, what's wrong with my code? I can't understand. Gogu, can you please help me? Hmm, Adi, but I'll give you only one hint, is that okay? Yes, yes. When declaring variables, you have to follow some rules. I am not telling you all the rules, just one for your hint. Use single words for variable names. Mrs. Nira will explain the rest. Okay, I'll change my variable names to single words. Thanks, Gogu. Hello, everyone. Did you solve your coding challenge? Yes, teacher. I tried, but kept getting an error. I did it, but I'm getting the wrong result. It only shows 10, not 150. I am happy you tried. Let me help you here. Eve, you use the same variable name for two different values. You need to use different names for different data. Like this. Should we always use single letters for variable names? No, not at all. I used pocket money as a variable, and it's not working. That's not permitted. First, I will tell you the rules so you all will understand it better. 1. They can be a single letter or a word. 2. They can combine letters, numbers, and underscores, but the first character must be a letter. 3. Keywords, which have special meanings in Python, can't be used as variable names. What's a keyword? Words with special meanings in Python. Can I use garden dash pots as a variable name? No, only underscores are allowed. So, it should be garden underscore pots? Yes, but it's better to use short, meaningful names. It makes your code easier to read. Like? Now I understand how to declare variables. Now I can practice more. How about Number of friends, NOF. Number of goals, goal. Seat number, seat underscore number. Marks in the fifth exam, marks five. Very good, kids. Keep practicing. Goodbye, everyone. We'll learn more next class. Bye. Bye. Today, Adi and his friends learned important rules for naming variables in Python. Remember to use single words, avoid keywords, and use underscores if needed. See you next time for more fun with Adi and Gogu.